Special shout out to Sergio from Hoasso HVAC who suggested that I spotlight either new tools to the market or tools that are new to my truck and I've got four of them to show you tonight. And as my other long time viewer, Biggie Fitz would say, toot toot, all you crazy tool cats, let's jump on board the Tool Hall Express. First, 26 piece hex wrench set from Gear Wrench. This has standard and metric hex keys in it, ball end on the long end, and the chamfered end on the straight short end. The standard size goes 0 0.05 inches all the way to 3 eighths of an inch. And the metric set 1.5 millimeters all the way up to 10 millimeters in half millimeter increments for the one and a half, two and a half, four and a half, and five and a half millimeter sizes. Comes in a great folding plastic case so it's easy to pick up and take with you or lay it flat out in your toolbox and you can see the sizes displayed right up front. Next they also have a 14 piece standard and metric T-handle hex key set, also from Gear Wrench. Not only do you have the long straight end, but on the shorter end also has a hex key of the same diameter as the long side. This set runs 3 seconds of an inch to 1 quarter of an inch on the standard size and 2.5 to 10 millimeter on the metric side. I've got these two together as a whole bundle deal that was sold to me by my distributor who was putting together their own gear wrench bundles. Also, brand new to the market, and I'm stoked to finally get these on the truck, the new Milwaukee hard-faced dead blow ball peen hammers. This first one is a 16 ounce hammer with a terrific non-slip grip and a wonderful feature of having a squared off flat side to the head so you can rest them straight up and down without it falling over. And the larger size is a 32 ounce hammer with the same features, terrific grip and the flattened head so that you can rest it without falling over. Terrific innovative ideas. Compare the quality to this hammer to the snap-on ones and don't be surprised when you see them going for about half the price. Lifetime warranty on everything I just showed you and I'm gonna put them on the truck this week. Hopefully they sell well and become regular inventory items for me. So keep watching the channel because I've got a whole bunch of new videos coming on the line, including some air tool repair videos that have some really interesting problems and I'll show you how I fixed them after I overhauled them, repaired and fully restored them. And of course the long form tools in the hall videos, which really are the bread and butter of this channel. So do me a favor and click down here now to subscribe so that you don't miss any of it. Thank you so much for watching and remember, use a tool, don't be one. <laughs>